Everybody has equal opportunity, and I think that is true for everything. My obsession is with technology and how it can improve human life. In my view, what we have seen in the last 300 years is only a trailer. I think that our fundamental belief is that for us growth is a way of life and we have to grow at all times. I am a big believer that whatever has gone lies in the past. You should only learn from it, and you should only look at the present and the future. That's been my father's philosophy and mine as well. I have always believed that technology drives human civilization's endeavor and progress. You have to manage money particularly with market economies. You may have a great product, but if your bottom line goes bust, then that's it. Profit or loss is not guaranteed. That depends on the consumer and depends on the product. That's a risk that business people take. I personally think that money can do very little. And this has been my experience all across. In the journey of an entrepreneur, the most important thing is self-belief and the ability to convert that belief into reality. Mobile Internet will be the single most defining technology of this century for human development. I don't think that ambition should not be in the dictionary of entrepreneurs. But our ambition should be realistic. You have to realize that you can't do everything. All of us know that the energy from the sun can now be harnessed, and we need to convert it sensibly to use it. I guess when you are left on your own, you find your true potential. I remember my father never came to our school even once. I wanted to pursue chemical engineering because I thought it was the future. I believe, 50 years from now, when you write history, one technology that would have changed human civilization is going to be the mobile internet. I generally think that I should only speak by action and not by words.